Hi everyone, this is Jean. I have a quick tutorial for you today. I'm going to show you how to use Make the Cut to wrap text. So basically, I will show you how I made this alphabet border with um, Make the Cut using the wrap text to path function. Now, I will not be showing you how to make this card. I'm just going to show you how you can use, um, how you can wrap text. Okay, so I have already prepare my card by tracing this graphic from lettering delights and that's the chalkboard and the gray rectangle indicates the card base so I will lock the two layers down and start a new layer so that I can bring in a rectangle from the basic shapes box And I will resize this rectangle so that it frames the chalkboard. Something like that. Now, essentially, it is going to be the path for the alphabet. And now that I have my frame, I am going to bring in the text. So because I have previously already entered all these letters, they are still there. And before I click accept to bring it to the mat, I need to show you that I select split by glyphs, which is essentially the same as um, auto split from the previous version. And now I'm ready to bring it to the mat. And because the size of the letters are too big right now, I will have to resize it. So let's just do 0 0.2 inches and I will hit enter. And now it looks so much better. Now holding down the control key, I am going to drag these letters and bring it over to the rectangle. And as soon as the cursor changes its, its shape, I will let go of both the uh, control key and my mouse. And now the text has um, basically wrapped around a rectangle. And as you can see, it is insufficient to cover the whole frame. So I will have to repeat the text. Maybe by another two times and actually at this point it looks pretty good now if it doesn't look good I could actually make more adjustments by moving these sliders but I'm not going to do that now because it, it does look kind of nice so I'm just gonna hit accept and once I have my text in I could delete away the rectangle and just for the sake of showing you how this um, frame would look like if I print it out right now I'm going to do a print preview and there you go there is my alphabet frame using the wrap text to object tool in make the cut okay so that's all for today's tutorial if you want to take a second look at my card you could head back to my blog under a cherry tree dot com thanks for watching this video bye bye